Hello everyone, in today's video I am going to show you a new feature of uh, Microsoft Endpoint uh, Manager where you can attach your SCCM to your tenant and upload the devices uh, to your cloud and take actions on them from the device blade in admin center. For that the first prerequisite is to have uh, Configuration Manager 2002 installed otherwise we will not see the option to enable the integration in the co-management tab if you do not have co-management enabled then also it would work you just have to right click on the co-management node and uh, configure it and enable tenant onboarding only so co-management is not a prerequisite for it but in my case i have co-management enabled so i'm going to use it anyway So currently I do not see an option here to enable the integration because uh, my SCCM is not running 2002. So let me upgrade it and then I would see the option to integrate SCCM and uh, Intune and enable device sync. So I'm going to pause the video and come back once the update is done. SCCM has now been upgraded to 2002 version and if I go to the properties of uh, co-management I could see the option to upload to Microsoft Endpoint Admin Center and I'm going to select all my devices. This checkbox enable Endpoint Analytics is to enable the Endpoint Analytics where we get the productivity score for our machines to give us some insight on how they are performing. So I'm not going to enable it, I will leave it unchecked and we'll do another video for this and for now I'm going to apply this and sign into my Azure account with Global Admin. This action will register an application in AAD tenant to authorize the synchronization of data to Intune. So this is going to create an application in my Azure AD. So I'm going to click on yes. And okay. Azure AD under all applications, if I search for config MGR SVC, I could see that the application has been created here. On the SCCM server, we can check the log file CM gateway sync upload worker.log and look for the message successfully uploaded data to and the URL. So it means now that the sync has completed and we have a connectivity between SCCM and Intune. Here I am on my Intune portal and now I could see all the devices which I have in SCCM listed here. So if I go to any device here and I see the options of sync machine policy user and app evaluation. So I, if I click on sync machine policy, it will start initiating a sync. And if I go on my SCCM server, in the CM gateway notification worker.log, I could see authorized to perform client action entry here. And now it has initiated uh, machine policy sync. So let us go back to our Intune portal and see what the status here so if i go to overview i could see that the machine policy has been completed so now once you have integrated your sccm and intune your help desk could have only a single portal which is this intune portal and from here they could initiate the policies on those machines they don't have to use sccm and switch back between intune and it does not require co-management to be enabled i hope you like this video please uh, like and subscribe to my channel and I will see you in my next video. Bye-bye.